All right, we are back with Dredge. Let's see what kind of deep sea abominations we can conjure up here from the ocean floor. All right, let's undock. And today we're going to head kind of inside the Gale Cliffs. Uh, at night, there is... Uh, we want these conger eels. I think they... They only come out at night. And you can only find them... Uh, within the cliffs here. So we're gonna just... Sail around. Use our spyglass. Now let's check that out. That's a shipwreck. Is that the one we explored already? It might be. Wreck fish. We gotta uh, put out our crab pots as well. Three point one meters. Should I run into that thing? Is that going to damage my ship? That looks uh, dangerous. Blackmouth salmon. All right. Unfortunately, I can't flip these. I can't, I can't flip the fish. I can only rotate them. Alright, let's drop our crab pot. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe there's a fishmonger we can sell our fish. An old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles toward you. Ah. Greetings. Don't get many visitors around here. What is it that you need? This place doesn't seem safe. Why do you live here? I have been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time. Truth be told, I've been reconsidering my position lately. I have been happy here for so long. My wife and I had such a beautiful life until the collapse. Now I'm alone and cut off by land and sea, left only one these with these trembling rocks on all sides. I could help you move to Ingfell. It's not that simple. My brother would never... You see, I used to live in Ingfell with my brother. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad. We fought a lot, mostly about how our parents' inheritance should be divided. We were in the prime foolishness of our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here, I took the family crest. I stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Where is it? That's where the problem lies. After the collapse, that creature, it dragged debris from the houses down into its wretched burrows. The crest went down with it. It's a lost cause, I know. But if you were to find it, it's a large whalebone crest. It would mean the world to me. I'll look for it. Thank you, but please be careful. All right. Hello again. What can I do for you? Uh, do you know how I could clear the debris around here? Hmm, you probably need some explosives to shift those rocks. My brother Ingfell used to make explosives for that whaling operations you see. For the whaling operations you see. Nasty stuff. But with the whales all gone, I can't imagine he's still in business. What else do you want to know? So we probably have to get him and his brother to reconcile in order to get the explosives that we need. Uh, what am I supposed to be doing? You were going to keep an eye out for my family crest. 
It was dragged into the tunnels by that creature. It patrols the passageways of the cliffs, but its lair is somewhere toward the center by the large waterfall. Okay. I've marked the area on your map. Perhaps you could look there for it, but if it's too troublesome, don't worry about it. Large creature, huh? You know of any shipwrecks around here? Someone that used to live here kept their ship moored at the base of the cliff until it was struck by some falling rocks and sunk to the bottom. They were devastated at the loss. We were all... Uh, we were all. It was a beautiful boat, decorated with all manner of memorabilia from their travels. At low tide, I can see what's left, what's left of the masthead parking through the waves. What else do you want to know? Uh, what, what's happening to these cliffs? They're being consumed from the core by that hateful serpent. Have you seen it? Nobody believed me. Not until it started devouring our foundations, opening up chasms beneath our homes. It was nightmarish, waking in the night to the sound of a creature slithering somewhere underneath. It seems to have turned his attention elsewhere, but not before it took everything from me. Uh, tell me more about this creature. It's been burrowing tunnels through the base of the cliffs. You can see the gigantic holes as it leaves just below the surface. Hmm, okay. As it forces its way out, it often causes rock falls. So if you plan on going in there, keep an ear out. Alright. Will do. Should it catch sight of you? Well, you should be able to outrun it. It's quite slow, provided you can navigate the passageways. Alright. Um, apparently there is no... Whoops. Uh, there is no shop here. Undock. Alright, the shop's not far. I'm gonna go and... sell my fish. And then I'm gonna head inside. It's still early. We have a little bit of time. Hmm. Sell all fish. Tiger mackerel. Yeah, I guess we have to fish at these spots before we can uh, spot what kind of fish this is. Or maybe we don't have to fish at these specific spots. spots. We just have to catch these types of fish once and then we can identify what is at that spot. Maybe. Anywho, let's go inside the Gale Cliffs through this archway here. Okay, I heard a roar sound. Yep. Oh, oh god. Ah, uh, uh fast. God. Did he damage? Oh, I damaged my ship. Shoot. Did I just get unlucky there? Can I get in there without him spotting me? Hmm. Alright, well. We can't go back in. Not right now. Might as oh, I was gonna say might as well do some fishing. Um, nope, that's not gonna happen. We can probably dredge this stuff up. Yeah, my fishing pole is uh, gone.
One more. Oh no. I can't pick up three of them. Goodbye, metal scraps. Alright, time to head back. Um, our lights are on, right? Yeah, okay. I'm tempted to just run into that. But I think it'll damage my ship. I need to go to the dock. No, not the dock. The shipyard. Mm. Your boat sprung a leak. We should fix that. Yes, indeed. Repair all $60. Alright, let's rest. Uh, let's try that again. I think I can outrun him. I'll be ready for him this time. I'll have my haste ability selected and ready to go. Okay, he's coming around. Can he... Oh, God. Oh, no way. He can come out of his hidey hole? He just patrols... Around the entire uh, island? Oh man. Oh. Alright. Oh, wasting so much money on these repairs. Well, we wasted more time. Uh, undock. Third time's the charm, right? Alright, if I hear that earthquake, I'm going to bail. Let's try over here. Hey, research part. Lumber. More lumber. Even more lumber. All right. Maybe we'll get that eel that we need. We can only find them at night. Not here, obviously, but... Uh... Well, that's a different type of minigame. Stonefish. Okay.
blackmouth salmon. What was that other thing? Abyssal. Oh boy. Alright, let's select our haste ability. And uh, we're gonna go back here. Hey, we got a new type of uh, crab. Can't pick up the other one. Ah, uh, there's that glow. Alright, now, while we're here, let's check the floating dock. Can we get any more upgrades? Um, yeah. We're running out of cloth. Uh, tier 2 hole upgrade. This is what I really want. Now, we won't be able to get this right away. We need more cloth. And uh, they sell a refined metal. We need to buy that. does it cost 500 yeah we need we just need money we do have two research parts I don't really see the need for larger crab pots right now Tr improved troll net What is a troll net going to get us? Great option for passive income. Huh. Installing a troll net is a great way to earn some passive income while exploring the islands. Yeah, I guess, um... Just so we don't have to... Uh, just so we can catch fish by... Just exploring. And we'll just leave the net out. I guess that's how it works. As we... As we ride. I'd have to replace my hydraulic rod with it though. Put it in storage. Alright. Let's let's try it. Let's uninstall that. Put it in storage. Take the troll net. And install it. Luckily it doesn't cost money to install it. Just time. Okay, so we'll try it out. See what it gets us. Rest. 
So now we can't fish uh, any ocean at any ocean spots, but... No, not rest. Oh, crap. Wrong button. Um, but that's okay. Because we're going to be exploring the Gale Cliffs for a bit. Alright, what do we got here? I know you. Select the troll net ability with E and lower it. Okay. Oh god, I can hear it. Come over here. He's literally still chasing me. Oh, no, no, no. It's not going to slow me down, is it? Better not. This is Oceanic? Nah, can't do that one. Dang it. We got a shipwreck. Oh god. Let's try the shipwreck. Silver trinket? Okay. I wanted to try that before I finished with these. Thought it might be something more special or substantial. Last one. Well, oh, 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 get away from me. Oh, we don't want to mess with that thing. I don't know what it is, but I know I don't like it. Wonder if I can actually die in this game. It is 3 a.m. If you don't get some sleep, you'll start seeing things. Why don't you rest up before heading back out? Yes, that is my plan. Did my net not... Oh, I, I, I sold all my fish. I should have checked my net. There was some stuff in there. So I guess it has its own inventory. It doesn't share with the cargo, which is great. Alright, let's... Uh, 
Let's rest. Undock. Um, boy, this is gonna be... This is gonna be tough. There's a special fish here. Let's, um... Let's try that out. Decaying black mouth. Well, you're lovely. Uh, all right, I'm heading in. Oh, he's right there. a failure. I do need this cloth, though. So I'm going for it. One more. Come on. Last one. You're a tiny little fish. Stonefish. Yeah, I was kind of surprised that the, uh, the big, the big dude, I can hear him again, great. He, um, he did a U-turn. Caught up with me. Oh boy. Let's see what's in my net. All right, I'm getting some decent stuff in my net here, which is nice, but now I gotta repair my dang ship again. Sell all, 128. And go to the shipyard. Repair all 100, yeah. I if I'm using all my money for repairs, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna get anywhere. Alright, let's go to the floating dock. We can add some more stuff here. We do have the three bolts of cloth and um, lumber. So, all I need is the refined metal. What, what I'm gonna do, I think, off camera, I'm just gonna go around and collect some basic fish, get some money. And then we'll be right back and we can buy this refined metal. The stone hums quietly, sending ripples through the air around it. Faint shapes stance upon its surface, vanishing before your eyes can focus on them. Okay, I found this as I was exploring um, on the outside of the Gale Cliffs here. Place your hand on the stone. Cold stone does not respond to your touch. Okay. So we'll have to come back here. 
I'm almost done making money. We've almost we almost have enough for the um the item that we need for the whole upgrade and then the whole upgrade itself. All right. Well, I spent uh 3 days, I think, just uh sailing around, fishing, selling my fish, making money, and I now have enough money to buy where do I buy it? Shipyard to buy this refined metal. Mine now. And I also have enough money to purchase the upgrade. 500. Let's do it. This is going to give us a tier 2 hull. Hull can sustain one additional impact. That'll be uh, quite useful because we keep, we keep taking damage from that giant abomination and adds five new cargo spaces do it yes oh also we got a book uh from this lady when i came back here a couple days ago art of the silver tongue and we're almost done reading that well that's great all right yeah that's the hermit quest Find the family crest. Uh, so yeah, we let's look at our cargo. Okay, I'm not sure where the additional slots are. There's these two new engine slots. Those weren't there before, were they? Yeah, I'd like to compare it from the big one, from the old one to the new one. See what what the difference is, but it. It's definitely bigger. Okay, so that's going to help a lot. Alright, now next time we're going to figure out a way around that nightmare abomination fish because there are items that we need and at least one type of fish that we need that's in there. So we got to go in there. No way around it. We just got to avoid that nightmare fish. <laughs>